Hello everyone. In today's video, we will be talking about quantified nutrition. What does it mean? Should you incorporate it in your lifestyle? If yes, then how? Let's first state some basic facts. Our daily caloric intake and expenditure determines whether we lose, gain or maintain our weight. Calories in versus calories out is the most important equation in our fitness journeys. Food is made up of macronutrients that are carbs, fats and proteins and micronutrients that are vitamins and minerals. Water and fiber are an important part of our diets too. How much should we eat depends on our goal. This is the caloric aspect of the nutrition. It is nothing but a scientific approach to planning a diet focusing on not just your calories but also on your macronutrients as well as micronutrients. What is quantified nutrition? Simply put, if you follow quantified nutrition, you will find out how many calories you are allowed to eat in a day depending on your goal. Use this number of calories as a base and then further divide them into carbs, fats and proteins. Make sure your micronutrient requirements are fulfilled either through food or supplements. Keep a tab on your water intake as well as the fiber. Finally, trust the process. Let us take a simple example of two friends, Ram and Lakshman. Ram has 2000 calories to consume in a day. He wants to lose weight and keeps his protein at 35% of his diet. This means Ram should consume 700 calories of protein in a day. For this, he needs 175 grams of protein since protein has 4 calories per gram. Next, he wants to keep his fat at 25%. This means he can consume 500 calories from fat sources, which means 55 grams of fat in a day. Lastly, his carbohydrate consumption will amount to the remaining 40% or 800 calories for which he can intake 200 grams of carbohydrate. Ram weighs the raw ingredients and cooks with the measurements to know his caloric intake. Ram has just followed scientific approach of quantified nutrition. Now let us work with Lakshman. He wants to lose weight and finds out he too needs 2000 calories in a day to do so. Lakshman doesn't believe in science and so he begins by dividing his calories into three big meals and two small meals in a day. His plan sounds effective but he doesn't know the calorie sources and misjudges his calories. He also doesn't take enough protein. There are way too many distractions in his diet and so he gives up. So who are you like, Ram or Lakshman? 